What's going on YouTube? RDC1516 here. We are going to do a man cave edition uh, and also show all my autograph collection. So we're in the Gator man cave. You can see pretty clearly where we're at. I'll give you a little pan around the room. Got a poker chip uh, collection there from all the rooms I've played in. You got some Albert stuff on the walls. I got the one on the left in New Orleans this year at the World Series. Poker. Got uh, those other two were custom paintings, and then one in the middle is a custom um, Gator logo on a crate. Uh, we're going to go through all these Gator autographs. We're going to go through all those Gator autographs. We'll go through that, and then we'll get to all the stuff in the Gator autograph collection case. All right, so let's start with the stuff on the Gator poker table. <laughs> We'll go through the basketball first and baseball just to get you out of the way. But uh, nothing too spectacular here. Just some random basketball players. Mainly a football collection, but if I see one on eBay cheap, I grab it. All right, Demarcus Robinson, you see the Vernon Hargraves. Here's all this year's draft picks for the most part. You got Kelvin Taylor, Jake McGee, who was badass last year. Got Going down, you got Bullard. Um, Dante Fowler, who should be really good in the NFL this year. He blew his Achilles out last year. Uh, and then you got Elam, who's been kind of a bust. Bostic, who's been okay. Uh, and then you got Gillisey, who's kind of bounced around a little bit. Only really had one good year at Florida. It's kind of sandwiched around some other decent guys. Uh, Jordan Reed, who I think is one of the better tight ends in the league, and uh, was a quarterback at Florida and switched to tight end and has really developed in the NFL with the Redskins. All right, uh, Gillisey, Patches. More Elams. And then you got my favorite player, Spikes. Um, the murderer, Hernandez. I just, I had a lot more of him and either threw it away or sold it off. But uh, I kept, I just kept one. One, one solo card. Um, Riley Cooper, Nelson, David Nelson. Good guy. Uh, still keep, still keep up with him a little bit on Facebook. You got the Percy autographs all through here. So if you, if you want to have a play a little game, see if you can count the Percy's throughout this video. See if you can tell me how many Percy autographs I have. They're in four different spots throughout the video. So keep your eyes open and you'll keep seeing them. Uh, I believe there's like 13 on-card Gators. I may be off by one or two, uh, at least over here. Uh, you got Lewis Murphy. You got the nameplate, obviously, with the Gator logo caps. Pretty cool. And then you go through here. Get a little older, 2006, 2007 time frame. A lot of the players on the 06 championship team. Go through here, you get to the Zook era guys. There's not many NFL guys from the Zook era. Uh, Deshaun Wynn, really a Zook era guy, but you know had his best game under Urban. And you got the Jack Youngblood and Spurrier pro uniforms hiding back there. And you got all the early 90s Gators from Spurrier's teams through here. Pretty cool Travis Taylor card. I like that card a lot. Uh, the old two dollar phone cards, probably not even worth two dollars, even with the on card and the two dollar phone card. Obviously, you can call for free today. Um, Lido Shepard, uh, pretty cool Gator autograph. You get all the Chris Leak, all the press pass stuff, which will be no more. Um, some Gator uniforms for the pros. Gator College uniforms all through there and on and on and on. Um, take a quick side detail tour, give you one more shot of the table with all the autographs all laid out. Give you a little scale of what the poker room looks like. Um, no big money games, just friends having fun, playing poker, watching sports. <laughs> um, Go over here, 1997 Tiger Woods, Arnold Palmer autographs on badge, pretty cool stuff. Johnny Damon, and then you got some other autographs, uh, well, other autographs, Smoltz and Maddox. These are the only two autographs in my collection that are uh, replicas. So my grandma gave them to me, and I didn't have the heart to, to tell her, so I've kept them up. <laughs> um, so Billy Donovan on jersey autograph is kind of Hard to see on camera, but it is there, and you can kind of see it right below the 07. Pretty cool. Uh, Chris Collinsworth. A lot of people, I guess, forget he's a Gator or don't know he's a Gator. And you got this is this is a really cool set. These conference greats. You got John Reeves, um, Carlos Alvarez, Shane Matthews, 
War, uh, Danny Warfel, Ike Hilliard, uh, Dominic Easley, and then some other Gators, Chris Doring, um, Doug Johnson, and then you got uh, the Leaks, Brandon Seiler. That's a, about the only Gator uniform card I could ever find of him. Um, he was like the team leader on the defense on the 06 team that won the championship, and then Jarvis Moss was a big part of that. Uh, Seatrick Faison was, was one of the running backs when I was in college. C4 uh, was actually a pretty good player, um, just didn't have a lot around him. Uh, Chad Jackson, kind of another similar story, very good receiver, didn't have a lot around him. Um, then you got uh, Andre's brother, Roche, I think he's in jail right now. Uh, Travis Taylor, Taylor Jacobs, Javon Curse, Mike Peterson, Daryl Jackson, Jaquez Green, some Warfels, one of my favorite Warfels right there, that tops, both throwback. Uh, Rick Caceres, Rex Grossman, should have won the Heisman. Uh, Percy Harvin and Tebow UD Blacks. And then you got your sweet spot Gator helmets, the two Joe Haydens, uh, the Spikes Rainbow. I did have the Hernandez Rainbow, but uh, I actually threw that away. Um, well, I sold it. I sold it really cheap. It's thrown away. Um, <laughs> let's see here. Mike Gillisey, uh, UD Black, exquisite autographs. Uh, very nice gator patch head on there uh, out of five. And then his uh, uniform card, something from his gator uniform. Jack Youngblood, Spikes, Hayden, Pouncey, Louie. There's a UD Black Percy, I'm missing the quad. Um, school color Percy, one of my favorite Percy uh, gators. Uh, Percy little mini card, uh, Janoris. Jenkins, Easley, Burton, Dante Fowler, Beast, uh, Vernon Hargraves, also a beast. Gonna, I think he's going to do well in the NFL. Uh, very professional, just solid player. Does get banged up a little bit though. So if he if he doesn't do well, I think it's because of injury. I don't think it's because of talent. Uh, Bullard, I think he'll do really well in the NFL. Um, Demarcus, I'm, I'm stocking up on his cards because I think he might have a surprise season. A little bit better than I think people realize. Uh, Fred Taylor, pretty sick patch right there out of the, the Jaguars. Uh, Percy Harvin, very sick patch. So you got the Percy Harvin prime patch, triple theads. Percy Harvin, low numbered, exquisite auto. Percy Harvin, I think out of five, National Treasures, Colossus game use patch. And then the SP Authentic, low numbered. Um, then you got some non Gator collection, but still pretty cool stuff. Bo Jackson, game use, nice patch on card. Uh, and the Frank Thomas, very nice patch on card. Uh, Greg Maddox, Tom Glavin, John Smoltz, Relic, Otto, and then you got the Jones brothers, Chipper, and Andrew. So uh, that's the high end case. Uh, got a little Jack Youngblood autograph there. Got a little uh, thing my wife made me with all the Gator championships. The tickets from 2006. Uh, really nice tickets. I think it was like the 100th anniversary of the Gators. Yeah, that's what it was. And so the tickets are super nice from that year, which is great because um, they ended up winning the championship, so we got to frame them. Um, anytime we win a championship for football, I'm going to frame them. <laughs> I thought I was going to run out of frames, and then uh, we lost Urban, so hasn't been the case. Uh, Urban, uh, <laughs> Urban, Auburn was the only loss that year. I was at that game. And then you can see all this from the 08 season. There's the old Miss loss on there, the Promise game, uh, the SEC ticket, and then the BCS ticket which if you, you can't really see it, but it's got uh, some water damage just because we were partying a little bit after the game. But, um, you know, I'm not trying to resell it, so kind of cool, actually. It was one of my good friends. So here's all the pro Gator uniforms. I'm not going to go through in detail, just maybe show you a couple of the hits. And the Percy's, of course. There's the Fred Taylors, the Javon Curse in the back there, your Jack Youngblood, your Neil Andersons. And let's see. Matt Jones, I actually just pulled that today. Um, and then all your Percy's. So there's another Percy watch. Get a good look at those. And then all the spikes, you know. Doesn't have a lot of cards, but he's one of my favorite players. So going through. Got the last but not least detail of the tour of the Gator autograph trophy case. Uh, some gifts from friends on the bottom. The Percy, big, big prestige Jumbo rookie card. Another version of that Jack Youngblood autograph. Got that so cheap I couldn't pass it up. 
Matt Moore was signing at the BCS game, got that. Uh, Urban on football, Emmett on uh, photo, very sick autograph, black and white, but except for him. And then we go up here, we got the Fred Taylor on football, Florida Gator crayon. That helmet has David Nelson, Tebow, Spikes, Percy, um, Cornelius Ingram, and uh, Lewis Murphy. Um, Brandon Spikes on football, the alligator from the basketball championship in the background, the alligator, or the Gainesville Sun from the football championship, uh, 1984 Coke with the nice Albert logo, um, random mini helmet signed by D. Finley. I, mean, I don't think he ever even made it to the pros. Uh, and a bunch, I'll show you this, this is just a bunch of tickets from some of my favorite games, like some Georgia games, Florida games, bowl games. I mean, Georgia, Georgia, Florida State, or Florida, Florida State, Miami, stuff like that. Just one that I want to keep. Going up top, kind of the finale. We'll start over here. Uh, Mike Gillisey, Auto, Patch Auto. Uh, um, who's that? Oh, Richie Martin, uh, baseball player I kind of like to watch. Uh, then you got Neil Anderson, you got Spurrier and his wife, I guess, um, which is a pretty old school pick when he was a quarterback at UF. You got the other version of that Neil Anderson jump, both signed by him. Then you got the college ticket signed by Percy, kind of an unusual Percy autograph. Uh, Demarcus Robinson, Demarcus Robinson out of black gold. Uh, so I just kind of keep new ones and ones I want to look at up there and then before I file them away. So do a quick recap for you and look around the room. You know, got the couch up here, obviously, watching some SEC Network right now, getting ready for college football next week, which is what kind of inspired me to do the video and show off the man cave. Um, if you're still watching after 12 minutes, thanks for your thanks for your view. And uh, feel free, if you got any Gator stuff to trade uh, that you think I might be interested in, doesn't have to just be cards, as you see. Um, I collect it all. Uh, let me know. Don't tell my wife. And I uh, appreciate it.